and welcome to my channel. My name is Kika and today my friends we are gonna go Christmas crafting and I'm gonna try out this do-it-yourself Christmas wreath out of baubles. This is a product I saw on <laughs> Pinterest <laughs> and I thought it's perfect because we're not gonna have a Christmas tree this year because we're gonna fly home to Finland and celebrate Christmas there but I have all these decorations so I thought this will be the perfect chance to do something with them and I'm gonna try it out and share with you and we can see together the end result, how it turns out. Also, uh, if you enjoyed this video, then please subscribe and hit that notification bell and thumbs up. Then you'll get notified every time there's a new video. Also, let me know if you like this kind of crafting tutorial, do-it-yourself kind of videos, uh, so then I can make more of them. Okay, so for this project, we're going to need just a wire hanger and then lots of Christmas baubles. And the first step is that you uh, bend this open. Um, so I actually did this already last night because I wanted to see that it actually works. So whoa. I've uh, kind of made it into this kind of round shape. It's not perfect, but I don't think it has to be perfect. And I used this kind of hobby pliers, kind of wire cutter thingy, you know, the one. So um, it was a little bit tricky, especially like this part up here. Um, so be careful if you do this. All right. And then, um, as I understand it, we're just gonna start piling on these baubles onto this. Um, and I've chosen to go with kind of pastel-y colors, like golden and bronzy and some pink. Um, <gasps> Alright, should we start? Let's start. Okay, I feel like I need to have something like, to see the baubles a little bit better, so I'm just gonna pour them out on this thing. <gasps> So my plan is to kind of have the smaller bubbles on the sides here and kind of make it bigger as I go. This wasn't completely even my wire when I had like kind of tried to smooth it out, um, and that's now where they get stuck. Okay, now I should probably put one of my big ones. Okay, okay let's see how does that look. Oh yeah, I mean it's definitely coming together nicely. It's much more pink than I actually had thought initially, like from just looking at the bubbles, but I'm, I'm fine with that. I'm kind of out of bubbles. sacrifice for the video. <laughs> so now I'm just gonna sort of whoop, close it with some wire. I don't know, do I need more of them? I think it's fine. I think we're gonna close it. I think we're gonna say that's enough. I don't know if I can close it the same way. Probably not. Oh. Okay, uh, no. Okay, I'm gonna just do like that and then I'll take a piece of wire and just close it. Ta -da! And this is how it turned out. I am really, really glad with how it turned out actually. All right, so the final touch we now need to do is this part doesn't look so great. So what I saw on Pinterest people had did was to have like a big bow, like a big ribbon. And I don't really have that, but um, I went and took the ribbon from my bathrobe. <laughs> so I'm gonna see if I can sort of um, wrap that around and kind of make it uh, look a little bit less ugly. I'm gonna see, like, probably want to have like maybe that much. So we're gonna see if I can just kind of wrap this around. So actually I would like to have maybe a kind of light colored ribbon and not necessarily pink, like this became very pink. <laughs> but uh, maybe I'll just then switch that later. I buy some kind of thick ribbon because I don't really have, I thought I had. See, this is why you should never throw anything out. Thank you. 
much for watching this little quick tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you will try it out. Let me know in the comments down below if you do and how it turns out. Uh, also, if you want to come and say hi and see more of the stuff I make, uh, I'm over at Udwakika on Instagram. All right, I'm gonna find a place to hang this up now. See you next time. Bye!